In today's Matchday Vlog, Warsaw seek revenge after last week's loss in the league against Melbourne. This week, Warsaw face Melbourne again in the first round of the Papa John's Cup. If you are here, make sure to subscribe to the channel. We are closing in on 200,000 subscribers. Go down and click it. It literally takes two seconds and I cannot appreciate you guys enough. Now let's get into the video. Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video. Now you're probably wondering why am I not in my Warsaw kit and it's actually Monday, so it's the day, two days after my game, but there is an explanation. So if you've watched these videos before, you'll know I filmed my morning because it's a match day vlog and it's like showing the full day of game day and I had filmed the morning of the game day. However, before filming the game, I'd formatted the SD card on the camera so I'd lost all of the morning's footage except the game and I've tried to get it back this morning, tried to recover the files, but I had no luck. So yeah, I've literally just got the game footage for you guys there wasn't anything really that exciting that i did in the morning i got some new boots which if you got me on tiktok or instagram you would have seen those so yeah that's technology annoying but let's get into the game So in today's squad lineup, a pretty similar team that went out against Melbourne last week. However, a few injuries in the team, so there's a couple of boys stepping up. So in the forwards, in the front row, we have got Ben Cooper, Rich Wilson, and Simon Weaver. In the second row, we've got Lucas Cottrell and Mike Lockett. And then in the back row, we've got Neil Holden, Max Hughes, and George Perkins at eight. In the backs today, we've got the return of Dean Ainger at nine, Toby Smith at 10, Adam Nunney and Hanson Christofferson in the centers, me and Dan Carpenter on the wings, and Ben Pitio at fullback. So here we are kicking off into the first half, um, a perfect day for rugby. Wind wasn't too bad. The sun is out as well. Uh, Toby now just clearing our lines straight from the kickoff, which goes into their winger. Winger then steps on the outside of Dan, but Dan with a great cover tackle there. Uh, Melbourne on the attack, and literally within the first couple of minutes, the seven breaks through our lines and gets under the post for a try, um, literally in the first couple of minutes, which they get the conversion for. So not a good start at all for Warsaw, conceding within the first couple of minutes. Um, this was not looking good for us. So Warsaw now into Melbourne's half, Ben just taking that in and crushing in himself. Warsaw looking to try and build some phases, George taking that in. Uh, we're looking for a good reply as they have just scored. Toby spreads that to me, I've got no space here. So I just put a kick over the top but that ball does go dead. So Melbourne scrum here, and there are eight tries to pick out, but Dean putting the pressure on, doing what Dean does. Um, Melbourne now on the attack. Uh, some big shots there from Cotty, um, and another shot there from Cotty to keep them in the half. The 10 then spreads that a little bit wider, 13 takes it in. Then Melbourne looking to spread the play, they go wider. I'm stuck here with a two on one, just trying to track that outside player. I do go for the inside man, uh, but then Toby is there to cover those tackles. Then Melbourne applying the pressure, just coming into our 22 now, looking to play some expansive rugby. They do manage to take it to the edge, but a good tackle there. Now Melbourne scrum here, nine gets that out the back, but Warsaw with a penalty, and this did show throughout the, the game, Warsaw's scrums were really strong. Uh, Warsaw now playing some expansive rugby themselves. Ben getting that wide into Dan. Dan just steps around the winger, gets the offload to me, but he was called back for going into touch. A couple of minutes later now, Melbourne on the attack, nine goes into their 10. 10 takes that to the seven, but great tackle there from Dean. Um, again, Warsaw just trying to defend and push them back into their own half, which we do get the turnover. Nunny then spreading it wide. Max with a bump off there. He gets the offload into me. I'm running. I've got no space, so I put a little chip over the top. Dean's chasing that, and Dean gets there first and gets down for a try. So good response from Warsaw, and we've got our first try. Melbourne line out now, overthrown into Maxi. Maxi just stepping that and taking that in himself. Then it comes out to Toby, Toby steps back, kicks the ball and clears the lines there. Warsaw scrum now just inside our half, comes out to Toby, into Nunny. Nunny loops it back to Toby, Toby gives it to Ben. Ben's got options either side, he goes himself, steps and then gives it inside to Hansen. Hansen still a good way out but he gets over for another try which Ben also gets the conversion for absolute beauty. So Warsaw now taking the lead and uh, a line out here does go a little bit loose but Dean picks that up. Then Dean spreading it wide into George. George taking that in himself. 
Then we look to spread it wide even more. It comes out to me from Nunny. I give the pass to Ben. Ben then draws the player, gives the pass out to Danny. Danny then goes round the edge and gets under for another try. Now at this point there was a little bit of a scrap going on. Um, not too sure what was going on, but in this moment, I'd actually twisted my knee, which my knee's been fucked for a couple of weeks, and I couldn't walk, so I actually had to go off the pitch already. So I think since coming back from my hand, I tried to get back into training too quickly, and I had like some tendonitis in my knee, which is like an overuse injury, and I think I just came back into training too quickly. I strapped my knee up before the game, but I could feel it a little bit weak uh, in the start of the game, and then at this point, I just had to go off. Anyway, Warsaw in the lead still. Melbourne now with a scrum, just coming into our 22 but a great scrum there from Warsaw great pressure and we do manage to keep them up over the line and hold them up so now with the goal line kick uh, goes really deep into their 15 15 picks that up then spreads it left um, then they're on the counter attack great tackle there from Cooper and then Melbourne just coming into our half still trying to build the phases but Warsaw really Stepping up in defence, um, they're looking to spread this a little bit wider now. Great tackle here from Dean. It's good to see Dean back on the pitch. Melbourne now pushed back a little bit and Warsaw still putting the pressure on in defence. Looking to spread it wide. Um, a great tackle there from Nunny. Melbourne still on the attack and the 20 does break through a tackle here. He gets through, he's just one on one with Ben, but Ben does make that tackle. Then they look to spread it wide with some quick ball. Um, hands it out wide, but a great tackle there from Hanson to cover that. And Melbourne still coming into our 22, looking to spread it wide the other side. Um, they do get around the edge, but again, Warsaw coming in and defending. Um, and they go around the edge, but another good tackle there from Ben, and it is called back for a penalty. Melbourne go to the corner, they go with the line out, comes into their 10, it spreads that again, but the ball is loose, and we do regather the ball. Lucas then looking to get on the outside, gets the pass off to Dean. Dean is burning down the wing, he's there. I'll tell you what, the nine's coming back and the nine tackles Dean. If this was Dean about four or five months ago, he definitely would have got caught there. But a good tackle from their nine. Melbourne now with the scrum, and as you can see, Warsaw just disrupting the scrum as much as possible, winning another penalty. Then we look to play it with the backs. Nunny just taking that in, taking about four defenders with him. Then we look to spread it into George. George crashing that up in the middle. Warsaw five metres out now. Neil literally a couple of metres short. However, Melbourne do get the turnover. So Melbourne now with the line out, and you can see there 21 just breaks through a few tackles gets one on one with Dean Dean makes a great tackle there he does get the offload and then Melbourne still on the attack just coming out of their half uh, they look to spread it wider again uh, Danny getting across and getting the tackle on their winger um, and the offload comes into Ben and Ben just clears the lines goal line drop out now for Melbourne and it comes into Ben Ben looking to spread it wide looking for that space uh, puts a little kick through which then Dean chases their nine gets it and Dean puts him into touch and that was the first half done there so first half finished 19-7 to Warsaw a much better performance compared to last week we were a lot more structured in attack and defense um, and we really just kind of stepped up our game across the board so now it's time to keep this momentum going and see if we can put this performance in for the full 80 minutes so now going into the second half we knew what we needed to do applying the pressure and just keeping this performance for the rest of the game Warsaw under pressure in the early couple of minutes of the second half uh, Toby does kick it as you can see from the wind here it goes about five meters but Toby does catch it again uh, good tackle there from the nine then we look to spread it with Nunny Nunny spreads it really wide out into Ben Ben looking for that space steps on the inside gets through the tackle half break there um, and then Nunny does kick it out so Melbourne now with the line out it is overthrown to George George catches that and then just takes that in um, crashing it in just Boshing players. Then we look to spread it wide with some quick ball. Hansen taking that in, um, just dragging defenders with him as well. Mitch into Lockett, lock it out the back into Toby, Toby into Weaver, Weaver crashes that in. Neil with a quick pick and go as well, um, just testing their defense in every area. Then we look to go a bit wider now. Toby tries to put that offload, which Ben does regather. Melbourne scrum here in their 22, and you can see from the scrum, Warsaw are just dominating uh, in the scrum today. A couple of minutes later now, Warsaw with a line out, Georgia 
just taking that in, absolutely bushing through players. Then it comes out to Weaver, Weaver breaks through the tackles, gets another couple of meters, bit of a high tackle there. So we've got the advantage, comes out to Nunny, inside to Dan, Dan breaks through a few tackles there, uh, gets the offload back into Nunny, Nunny into Lockett, Lockett out to Ben, and Ben puts a little chip over the top, which then nine is then forced to dot down. It's called back for a penalty, which Ben tries for the kick, but unfortunately he does miss that one. So 22 drop out now from Melbourne, uh, nice high ball, but it does go into George. George then just taking that in and Warsaw secure possession. Then Weaver on that blind side, um, stepping outside, taking that in. But unfortunately, it does go loose, but Dan picks it up. Dan then looking to step inside, looking for the gaps. Uh, gets the offload to Max. Max then gets another offload, but unfortunately, that one is loose. And Melbourne then do clear their lines, but that only goes as far as Ben. Who ben then steps back on that blind side, tries to go on the outside, but gets the offload to Weaver. Weaver takes it in. A bit hectic at the minute, and it's like we're trying to score every phase. Um, Nunny there spreading that to Hansen. Hansen then just taking that in. Um, we're just coming into their 22. Then we look to spread it again. Ben puts a really wide ball over the top but the 15 knocks it on and we are called back for a penalty so we go with the line out uh, the forwards just driving this on then Mitchie gets the ball out the back to Tobe Toby into Nunny Nunny then spreads it again into Dean Dean tries to step inside looking for a gap um, but he is caught in contact and takes it in Neil with a quick pick and go now and we are 5 metres out then with some quick ball comes out to Ben Ben spreads that into Lockett Lockett spreads it and then it goes out to Toby who breaks through and gets a score. Mitch with the conversion, nice, calm, collected, and he gets the extra two points. Warsaw now looking to exit their 22. Ben goes for a dummy through his legs, but does kick that out. Um, that does then go through the legs of the winger, I think, but the 15 gets the ball. Um, 15 then goes to spread it, and the nine does clear it, but that again only goes as far as Ben. Ben catches that, then spreads it wider into Toby, who Toby kicks it out, and some good meters gain there for Warsaw. Line out now for Melbourne, and it's overthrown into George again, and George absolutely bushes their nine, gets the offload into Isaac, Isaac just takes that in. Then it comes out to Toby, Toby gives that into Neil, Neil just crashing that in. Again, Warsaw applying the pressure in attack, uh, Toby forced to take it in himself, but it is looking promising. Isaac then taking that in, but Melbourne with some good defense and they do get the turnover. A couple of minutes later now, Melbourne on the attack with a line out, um, crashing that in, just entering into our 22, but some big tackles there from the boys. Um, they look to go out the back to the nine, nine spreads it into 21, 21 steps inside, but again, some good defense from Warsaw. Um, and we're really just trying to hold up this line now. We didn't want to concede and let the momentum shift. Um, and as you can see, Dean here making that cover tackle and Hansen, but the ball does go out. Melbourne now with a line out, just inside our 22 and a score here for Melbourne could literally turn the tables the momentum could shift and it would not be looking good for Warsaw and they're putting the pressure on and they do get another phase and they go under the post for a try which they also get the conversion for so it's not a good time for Warsaw to concede a try um, Ben here catches that puts another kick up himself, he's chasing his own kick, and with a great chase there, Ben does secure the ball again, gets the offload into Max, who takes that in. Warsaw scrum now, out to Nunny, Nunny into Hansen, Hansen crashes that in, taking in defenders with him. Then we look to go wider, Mitch into Isaac, Isaac just takes that in. Then we look to go the other way, Nunny sees the gap, he gets through, gets the pass off to Hansen, and Hansen is literally caught five meters out. Then we look for the quick ball, but there is a knock on there, so it goes back for a scrum. Scrum now for Melbourne, but you can see the pressure that Warsaw are putting on, and we force a mistake there. So then it's our scrum, comes out to Toby. Toby looks for a little chip over the top, but unfortunately no one is there chasing him, nothing comes of it. Warsaw line out now, great take from Max. Comes to Mitch, Mitch spreads that to Toby. Toby into George, George just taking that in. It's 26-14, there's not long left of this game. A score for Melbourne could really turn the tables, put the pressure on Warsaw. But as you can see, we are defending on our line, literally for our lives. We cannot afford for Melbourne to score this late into the game and put the pressure on ourselves. Which, just as I say that, Melbourne go over the line, but we do hold it up. Scrum now for Warsaw, comes out to Mitch, into Ben. Ben then puts a kick over the top. 
um, which goes into uh, fullback. Fullback then tries to step and bosh Dean. Dean with a lovely tackle there. Line out now for Warsaw. Comes into Isaac. Isaac takes that in. Then comes out to Max. Max with an offload into Nunny. Nunny then taking that in. Warsaw is still looking dangerous and we're still looking for another score um, just to put this game to bed. Toby there with a really wide pass over to Max. Max taking that in. Stepping inside. Max with some lovely feet there. Then Ben goes for a little grubber option. Round the back and we just pin Melbourne into the corner. Melbourne with the line out now, um, and as you can see, Warsaw putting the pressure on, and we do put them out into touch. Then Nunny taking this in. It's literally the last couple of minutes of this game. Warsaw still looking to put the pressure on. Hansen there taking that in, gets the offload to Ben. Ben breaks through, tackles, Bosch is the nine. Then he goes through, looks for the offload to Toby, but it is lost, and their winger kicks it out. Ben Pitio with a Bosch, I've never seen that before. Look at this for a goose from Maxi. Oh, lovely, and the Bosch, and another Bosch, and he takes it in. Then George with a pass into Isaac. Isaac breaks through the tackles, he's getting through. We're coming into their 22 now. Mitch then goes for a little kick, but there was an offside there. Scrum now for Warsaw, just inside Melbourne's 22, comes out to Toby. Toby into Nunny, Nunny inside to Dan. Dan breaks through, gets the offload to Hansen. Hansen taking that in, again, just cut short. Then we look to spread it wide through Toby. Toby comes the other way, takes that in himself. Um, it seems that Warsaw just can't find that little gap to get through and score the try. Um, and again, we're five meters out, we look to go back. Toby gives it to Isaac, Isaac takes it in, but unfortunately, Melbourne do get the turnover there. Now the final scrum of the game comes out to Toby, into Nunny. Nunny out the back to Dan, Dan puts a wide pass over the top to Dean, Dean taking that in, but unfortunately the ball was lost there. And Melbourne go with a quick free kick here. Um, the seven just lines up Dean, but Dean with a lovely tackle there. And in the dying seconds of the game, Melbourne attacking on our five, but there was a mistake and that was the game done. So the game ended there, 26-14 to Warsaw. A much improved performance compared to last week against Melbourne. And that is the first round of the Papa John's Cup done. Hopefully my knee is all good. Gonna be doing a lot of recovery this week so I can hopefully play this weekend. If you have enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe. So from me and another Matchday vlog, I'll see you in the next video.